When editing with Bricks, you can turn any element into a global element, allowing you to use this element anywhere else on your site. And if you make a change to one of those instances, they will be automatically applied throughout your site. We will have a look at one example right now. And this is the globalization of our map. We will turn this map element into a global map element. And I want to show you the settings I defined so far. So I have two addresses here and I also changed my map style to blue water. To now save this as a global element, all you need to do is to hover over this element and then you can see this little save icon here. And if you click it, it's gonna save this map as a global element and it's now available in our elements panel at the very bottom. So we just need to scroll down and you can see now here I have this new element group named global elements. And you can define as many global elements as you want. There's no limitation whatsoever. And you can also rename your global elements because if I have multiple maps, I don't just wanna, this is just by default, it's using the element name, but you might wanna specify this. So in my case, I will just call this um, something else and in order to rename it, I just need to click on edit element and then I can just click here on the element title and then I can name this um, map Europe, for example. So if I have a look now at my elements, you can see now my new name is immediately applied and all I need to do is just to save this page and we are going to drag and drop this element into a different page. So I already have a page here and uh, there's nothing in here and you can see it's um, not available yet because we just created this um, in another tab. So we just need to refresh our page. Once we've done that, we can just scroll down and you can see now that I have my global element here. If I drag it in here, you can now see that we have the same map in our new page and in order to illustrate how our changes are synced, I will just make a change here. I will remove this um, second address and then maybe I will also change my map style to light dream and then I save it here. I go back to this page and if I would refresh it you can now see that it's also using this one address here, Madrid in Spain, and it's also using our map style. So that's basically how you turn a global, uh, an element into a global element. You can create as many as you want. They will be automatically synced throughout your site. It's perfect for using elements such as maps or contact forms that you might want to use on your about page and on your contact page, a landing page, without having to recreate the same element and define all the settings over and over.